We are going to do a flow today focused on your solar plexus, which is your core, located right here above your belly button, below your diaphragm. And so it's going to have a little bit of core work. We're going to really empower our personal power, our confidence, our ability to choose, and our ability to persevere. So to begin, we'll get warmed up. Find yourself in a tabletop pose. Shoulders stack directly over your wrists, hips directly over your knees. Inhale, cow pose. Drop your belly, shine your heart, lift your chin, lift your tailbone. Exhale, cat. As you press the earth away from you, arch through your spine, pull your belly button up and in. Inhale, cow pose. Drop your belly, lift your gaze. And exhale, cat. Inhale, cow, warming up the spine, opening up through the chest. And exhale, cat, arching, creating space through the back line of the body. Find your tabletop pose. Ground down through your left palm and inhale your right fingertips in front of you. Exhale, press your left foot back behind, toes pointed towards the earth, sole of the feet reaching back as far as possible. Inhale to lengthen in opposite directions. And exhale, bring the elbow to the knee, pull the belly button towards the spine. Inhale, lengthen, slow and controlled, reach out long. And exhale, pull everything in towards the midline. One more inhale to lengthen. And exhale, release your palm and your knee. Now send the left fingertips out long, arm active and strong. Send the right sole of the foot back behind you, reach in opposite directions, take up space, breathe in. Exhale, curl, pull everything towards the center, crunch it in. Inhale to lengthen, take your time as you reach out long. And exhale, everything towards the middle, become a tight little ball. Inhale once more. And exhale, release your palm and your knee to the mat. Allow your toes to tuck under both palms, press firmly into the ground. Send your hips high, downward facing dog. Take a few pedals here, pressing your heels to the earth. Then find stillness with both heels reaching down, hips reaching up, and biceps by your ears. Inhale your gaze towards your hands. And exhale, ragdoll pose. Step your toes directly behind your wrists. Keep a generous bend in your knees as you drape your torso over your thighs. Maybe grab your opposite elbows and let your head hang heavy as you sway side to side. Good. Find stillness here in your ragdoll. Release your fingertips. Keeping that bend in your knees. Inhale to rise one vertebra at a time. Standing Tadasana pose. Once you've risen, give yourself a big shoulder roll, maybe two or three. And allow your shoulders to rest down your back. Inhale, lengthen the fingertips towards the sky, upward salute. Exhale, baby back bend. Shine your heart to the sky, we cactus open your arms. Press through the soles of the feet, lift up and out of the low back. Using the strength of your core, inhale, rise. Upward salute, reach the fingertips high. Exhale, forward fold. Hinge at the hips as you reach the crown of the head towards the earth. Inhale to halfway lift. Draw your palms to your shins or your thighs as you reach the crown of your head towards the front of the room. Pull your shoulder blades together. Create a long, strong spine, a flat back. Exhale, plant the palms, step the feet back, high plank pose. 
pause here, feeling the strength of your body. Everything active and engaged, hips lifted in line with your shoulders, a gentle bend in your elbows. Inhale, shift your weight forward, travel your shoulders past your wrists, and exhale, high to mid plank, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog, press the tops of your feet onto the earth, shine your heart forward. Using the strength of your core, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze towards your hands, and exhale your feet to meet your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Keeping a flat back, inhale, rise upward, salute. And exhale, hands to heart center. As we move through our sudden A, activate your Ujjayi breathing, the breath in and out through the nose. Allow your lips to remain sealed and a gentle constriction in the back of your throat to create more power and focus with your breath. Inhale, upward salute. Exhale, baby back bend. Inhale, lift up. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant the palms, step the feet back, high to mid plank, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze towards your hands. And exhale, your feet to meet your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise, upward salute. And exhale, baby back bend. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant the palms, step the feet back, high to mid plank, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze towards your hands. Exhale, your feet to meet your hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise, upward salute. And exhale, hands at heart center. Take a few breaths here, grounding yourself. Feel the earth beneath your feet. Active and strong through your legs, pull your belly button towards your spine. Allow your shoulders to stay relaxed down your back and just tap into how you're feeling in this moment. Our solar plexus is the center of our personal power. So feel that power within you. Inhale, fingertips high, upward salute. Exhale, chair pose. Sink your hips back all the way in your heels and in your hips. Your toes should be able to dance off the mat. Gaze down at your knees. Make sure you can see all 10 of your toes beyond them. Keep your belly button pulled in tight. Shine your heart forward. Exhale, moving just your arms, airplane arm behind you. Good, palms face one another like you're holding a giant beach ball. Activate your upper back. Keep sinking your weight into your hips and your heels. Moving just your arms again. Swim them forward. Chair pose. And exhale. Forward fold. Inhale. Halfway lift. Exhale. Plant the palms. Step the feet back. High to mid plank. Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale with control, downward facing dog. 
Inhale, right leg high, three-legged dog. Lift your heel towards the sky, point all five toes towards the earth. Press both palms evenly into the mat, and all ten fingers are active. Exhale, tiger pose. Pull your knee in towards your chin, arch straight your back, stack your shoulders over your wrists. Inhale, reach up, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee to right tricep. Good, activating our oblique muscles here. Stay strong. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee to left tricep. Pull it across your body and hold. Inhale, reach up. Three-legged dog. Exhale, low lunge with control. Stamp your foot between your palms. Ground down through your two strong feet and inhale, rise, crescent. Stack your front knee directly over your ankle. Your back heel is lifted. Both hip bones should point towards the front of the mat and gently tuck your tailbone to create more space for your low back. Gaze is forward, palms face one another. And exhale, warrior two. Press the knife edge of your back foot into the earth. Gaze out your front arm. Arms are long and strong, shoulders stacked directly over the hips. Inhale, reverse warrior. Lift your right hand up and overhead, fingertips high. Either rest your back arm on your back thigh or wrap it around your torso for a half bind. Exhale, triangle pose, keeping just a micro bend in your front leg. Reach your arms in opposite directions as you lift your torso towards the front of the room. Press through both feet, active through the arches, and lengthen through the spine using the strength of our core. Inhale, reverse triangle, moving just your torso. Again, use that strong core to move yourself up. Take up space here as you press through the feet and lift through the fingertips. Exhale, bend through your front knee as you find your low lunge, plant your palms onto the earth. Step that right foot back and flow through your vinyasa. Good, left leg this time. Inhale, left leg high, three-legged dog. Again, notice that all five toes are pointed towards the earth and both palms are pressing evenly onto the mat. Exhale, tiger pose, knee to nose. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, left knee, left tricep, pull it out to the side and hold for a breath. Good, inhale, re-extend. Exhale, left knee, right tricep. This time, pull it across and hold. Inhale, re-extend. Exhale, with control, find your low lunge. Good, inhale, rise, crescent. Open up through the front of your right hip here, finding strength and stability through your left leg. Keep the shoulders relaxed, but fingers active. Exhale, warrior two. Spin your back foot onto the earth, active through both arches. Keep the torso and core engaged, providing strength and stability through your spine. Inhale, reverse warrior. Lift your left arm up and overhead. Feel that nice side body stretch from your pelvis to your fingertips. Good. Exhale, triangle pose. Big transition as you straighten through the front leg. Reach the crown of the head towards the front of the room. Strong, stable through your side bodies and core.
Inhale, reverse triangle, slow with control. Inhale, the left fingertips high to the sky, take up space. Stay active through the core, void overarching in the low back. And exhale, smoothly transition to your low lunge. Then step the left foot back and flow through your vinyasa. Beautiful, take a few breaths here in your downward facing dog. Open mouth exhales to release any heat. As we move through our sun, sun V breath to movement, allow the consistency of your breath to find that power for you. Inhale, gaze towards the hands. Exhale, the feet to meet the hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, chair pose, sink low, arms high. Exhale, airplane arms. Inhale, chair. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant the palms, step the feet back, high to mid plank, chaturanga. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, tiger pose. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, right knee to right elbow. Inhale, three-legged dog. And exhale to the left. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, rise, crescent. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, triangle pose. Inhale, reverse triangle. Exhale, palms frame your front foot. Step that foot back and flow through your vinyasa. Good, inhale, left leg high, three-legged dog. Exhale, tiger pose. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, left knee, left tricep. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale to the right. Inhale, lift up. And exhale, low lunge. Inhale, rise, crescent. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, triangle pose. Inhale, reverse triangle. And exhale, palms to the earth. Step the left foot back and flow through your vinyasa. Find your downward facing dog. Take some big, deep breaths. Inhale, gaze towards the hands. And exhale, the feet to meet the hands. Inhale, rise, chair pose. Exhale, hands to heart center. Good, as you sink the weight back into your hips, into your heels, lengthen through your spine. And exhale, revolve, chair. Twist to the right. Hook the left arm to the outside of the right thigh. Gaze down at your knees. Make sure they're still in alignment with one another. Reach the crown of your head long. Create space through your spine. Work to get your torso towards the side wall and press your palms in towards one another. Good, just a few more breaths. Inhale, come back to chair. Exhale, forward. Full, give your legs a little shake. Good. Inhale, chair. And exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale to lengthen. And exhale to twist. Again, hook your right arm to the outside of your left thigh. Keep both knees in alignment with one another. And sink the hips back 
weight in the heels. Continue to reach the spine long, crown of the head towards the front of the room. Beautiful, one more breath. Inhale, chair. And exhale, forward fold, shake it out. Good, good, good. Ground down through your feet. Inhale, rise. Upward, salute. Bring the weight back into the left foot. And inhale the right knee in line with the hip. One leg at Tadasana. Find your stability here. Feeling the strength of your core. Exhale, warrior three. Create a capital T shape with your body. Reach your fingertips in front of you. Press the sole of the foot behind you. Keep your spine long and active. Feel your core supporting your entire body. Inhale with control. Find your one-legged Tadasana. Good, we'll do that. One more time. Exhale, warrior three. Move slow with control. Feel how your core is creating that stability as you move. Reach long in both directions. Fingertips active, toes pointed towards the earth. And inhale, rise. One leg atasana. Exhale, release. Shake it out here. Good. One more side to do. Inhale, fingertips high. Shift all the way into your right foot. Inhale, one leg is asana. Left knee in line with the hip, toes pointed forward. Pull the belly button towards the spine. Feel that strong, stable center from the bottom of the rib cage all the way down to the pelvis. That's your entire core. Exhale, warrior three. Kick your foot behind you. Reach your torso parallel to the earth. Gaze down at the mat. And feel the length and strength of your entire body here. Work to keep both hip bones pointed towards the mat, rather than letting your left hip fly open. Good, slowly with control, coming back up to one leg at Tadasana. Finding that point of stability. And exhale, warrior three, one more time. Really strengthening, really toning the core, turning on your personal power, your confidence, your perseverance. Use your full breaths to give you strength. Good, slowly rise one more time, one leg at Tadasana. And exhale, shake it out. Good job. All right. Inhale, upward salute, reach up tall, and exhale, back bend. Inhale, lift up, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, plant the palms, step the feet back high to mid plank. Inhale, upward facing dog, and exhale, let's press back to child's pose. Allow your knees to come open to the wide edges. Sink your hips back to meet your heels. Walk the fingertips out long and gently rest your third eye center on the mat. Take some big, deep breaths to reconnect, reground, and just check in with where you're at in this moment. Press your way up 
to a tabletop pose. And then gently find a seat. Arm, legs rather go long in front of you, toes pointed up. Inhale, guide your right leg over your left. Plant the right sole of the foot outside of the left thigh. Reach behind you with your right arm. Either tent your fingers onto the earth or plant your palm down. Inhale, lift fingertips high. And exhale, seated twist. Every inhale, think about lengthening through your spine. And every exhale, twist a little deeper. Want to lift up and out of the low back as you twist. Good. Slowly unravel. Find a quick counterbalance by planting both palms on the left side of your mat. Coming back to center, both legs out long. Give them a little shake. This time, Plant the left sole of the foot to the outside of the right thigh. Your left arm will come behind you to act as a second support. Inhale, right fingertips high. And exhale to twist. Hook the outside of your right arm to the outside of your left thigh. And then inhale as you lift through the chest, shine your heart, create more space through your spine. Exhale. Slowly unravel. Find a quick counterbalance, bringing both palms to the right. Both legs out long, scoot your pelvis towards your heels. Slowly with control, lower yourself all the way down onto your back. Bring your heels towards your glutes. Palms down, arms long by your side. Have your feet parallel towards one another and hip width distance. Exhale, bridge pose. Press through your heels as you lift your hips high. Option to walk your shoulders towards one another, interlace your hands and press your arms into the earth. Feel this opening through the front line of your body through your hip flexors and strengthening through your core, through your glutes, through your, your legs. Good, slowly lift your heels off the mat, unlace your fingers, and unwind your spine, one vertebra at a time. Bring your knees into your chest and rock side to side. Find stillness here and find your happy baby. Reach for the inner arches of your feet. Maybe wrap your peace fingers around your big toe. Work to keep your entire spine on the earth and open up through the hips. If it feels good, you can rock side to side here as well. Beautiful. Bring your knees in towards your chest. Wrap your arms around your shins. Pull your nose up to meet your knees. Take a big, big, big squeeze. Breathe in. And exhale. Release. Shavasana pose. Allow your arms to go long. Palms face up. Your legs to go long. Your toes to fall open. Close your eyelids. Relax your face. Allow your breath to deepen. Give yourself a few moments here to really just be present, relax, and breathe.
Thank you all for joining me for your vinyasa flow today.